A family grieving the loss of their daughter now facing another hurdle and even more heartache. They created a memorial bench with a plan to have a symbolic angel as the focus point. After several years, they are now being asked by the owners of Brownsburg Cemetery to remove it. rtv 6s Nicole Griffin is finding out why the cemetery won't allow it and what the family intends to do now. It's been a difficult journey over the last six years for Tanya Warren. Her daughter, Sarah, passed away in 2013. She overdosed. Yeah. And she never came back. She was just 27 years old. Tanya still remembers being by her side as they took her off life support. Listen to her heart stop beating. Remembering the good times, Tanya says Sarah always put a smile on her face. She was always my baby girl. She would sit on my lap. A special and now symbolic memory the two shared was Sarah decorating an angel Tanya had at her home. Sarah used to put sunglasses on them and she'd put silly hats on them. And now I do that with the same what I used to. Tanya and her husband Jay designed this memorial bench where Sarah is laid to rest at the Brownsburg Cemetery. Their vision was to make the angel the focus. But now emotions are running high after a year-long battle with the cemetery over removing the angel on the bench. We were there as Tanya and the owner discussed why the change was necessary. The feet hang out here. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Your feet is not... They the hang out here. of an angel. Then when the lawnmower comes through here with the uh, tires, mm -hmm. it hits the angel. The angel has already been damaged at least once by lawn care crews. The rules here at the cemetery state that all decorations must be placed directly on the gravestone and they cannot hang off. If I have stuff extruding, then it tears up a stone. I got to replace it. We asked if the owner would be willing to make an exception since they have had the angel there for several years. No, if I make an exception for them, I have to make it for them and them and them and them. Now a place that was once peaceful and served as a spot Tanya could grieve has become difficult to visit. I said, I just want to exhume my daughter and just bring her home with me. Nicole Griffin, RTV6. And the owners of the cemetery say they've tried to work with the Warrens by creating a post for the angel to sit on. However, Tanya says it defeats the purpose because it blocks words on the bench that were planned to be visible around the angel. So for now, the two remain at odds and the angel is removed.